Welcome to the video. Just picked up the kids from school. <laughs> 60 eggs, you already know. Uh, I can't buy any of the egg eggs now. I know where the eggs are from. They're like organic, locally farmed, like free range eggs. I can go see the chickens that lay these eggs. I mean, it's, it's beautiful. I mean, these eggs, and now I can't eat any other eggs. <laughs> That's so good. <laughs> I'm like a regular customer now at the uh, at the egg shop. Obviously, there's like 50 parking spaces here and they decide to park next to me, you know what I mean? And like nearly crash into my car, but what can you do? Gonna have an apple. I've eaten quite a lot today, but it's workout time. And we're gonna do it at the park because we love it. We love it at the park. Welcome back to the videos because I'm enjoying doing this and I'm getting more adventurous. Anyway, stop talking. I'll see you at the workout. So we're at the workout park, gonna get the workout in. Feeling a bit funky with my movement today, so I'm gonna try to muscle up some really good activation of the core and then some leg, and then we'll go from there. But the first exercises are gonna be uh, experimental and strength work, so let's do this. Welcome to the workout. So we're at the workout park today, just a playground, but it's got some good equipment. First exercise, we are focusing on muscle up technique using an assist with my legs to sort of get myself over the bar, focusing really on technique because we haven't unlocked the muscle up yet and it's so important in calisthenics and I really want to be able to do it. But let's go through the excuses. No, we're not gonna, but I am really tall and I've got really long levers and I think I weigh about 90 kilos. So I think if I can do it, then anyone can do it. So I really want to unlock the muscle up and that's what I'm working on here. Moving straight on to full leg raises. Now, like I said, I'm quite tall, so it helps that I found this bar, which is actually, I can fully hang off the bar, so that's really excites me. I will be back here just to hang on the bar, because there's not many bars in the world I can literally just hang off with my full body. So full leg raises, bit of momentum, but working on core activation and strength and trying uh, to work on the form as well because it's important that I can have a really strong core which will help with all my calisthenics movements. So just finishing off with a bit of hanging at the end. Final set was deep Cossack side lunges, I think they're called. This one was the only leg movement for today and it was just to sort of open my hips up. It was the first workout of the week. Get the single leg workout going. So just working on single leg really deep. As you can see, I'm getting really nice and deep into the hips. And what this is doing is helping with flexibility, strengthening those deep positions, and also working on gaining the pistol squat strength as well. So I think having long femurs and long levers in general don't help with pistol squats and muscle ups and pull ups, all of that. So I'm really trying to master all of that. So anyway, boom, boom, bang. <laughs> yeah, just a bit of boxing at the end. Yeah, I already know. So three sets of that, and that felt really nice, really warmed up the body. Then I moved on to three sets of pull-ups. So I did a superset with pull-ups, but we'll go on to that in a second. Just focusing on form. So wide grip pull-ups, and as you can see, full hang at the bottom and a full squeeze at the top. I'm going way past 90 degrees. My chin's going way over the bar and these felt really nice. So supersetted that with straight bar dips. So almost I'm simulating the muscle, muscle up in different positions. Went for muscle building reps on this one, so about 10 to 12, and this felt really nice. I'm really enjoying straight bar dips at the moment. Anyway, hand over to Rory to have a, another little chat with you. It's peaceful out here. It's my sort of meditation, my dojo where I go to better myself where I go to find a bit of peace it's by the river as well this place so it's like a it's got good energy trees quiet and you're trying to better yourself so what more do you want focusing on form as you've seen with the pull-ups and dips those pull-ups feel so nice at the moment honestly I've I used to rush them. I used to get like 10, 12, maybe 15 reps on pull-ups. And I realized they're all a bit, what am I engaging? So after doing loads of pull-ups that with proper form, it feels a lot nicer. So I'm going to go for another set of that. And yeah, 
Feeling good. Feeling pumped. We got this. So back on the pull-ups. This is the second set of the pull-ups. And you can see I'm starting to get more of a straight body, trying to cancel out the swing. But you see the form. You see the form. I see the form. This is something I've been doing recently. I've been lowering the reps on my pull-ups and just focusing on form. And wow, the pump is the pump feels harder. It feels like I've got a nicer pump. Oh, actually, at the end of that, ooh, I know, I discovered something there. Anyway, so second set of dips. These are feeling nice. And yep, yeah, straight bar dips. You can see my hand position there as well. It's in the muscle up position. If I was any wider or any closer, that would be working on wide muscle ups and close muscle ups. But I think the only muscle up I want at the moment is just the neutral grip one. But these dips felt nice. Chest, shoulders, triceps, all of that. Okay, final set of the pull ups. What I wanted to do was a little pause because at the end of the last ones, I felt like, ooh. I've got such good activation going with the low reps, perfect form that I wanted to squeeze at the top, squeeze at the middle, squeeze at the bottom. And as you can see, last rep, really nice, just came down. That was a game changer. And if you're wondering, oh yeah, I'm getting a bit, mm, my pull-ups aren't feeling great, just lower the reps and focus on form. It's helped me massively. Final set of dips then, still getting it in. The shoulders are pumped, the chest is pumped, and yeah, I'm feeling really good, really happy with straight bar dips. I am much preferring them to parallel bar dips, but that's just what it is at the moment. Next week, I'll probably be making a video saying, oh, parallel bar dips are the way forward, man. But anyway, yeah, straight bar dips for now. Three sets of each, and that's the workout. Over to me again. Yeah, boy. I'm gonna call it a day there. Save some for tomorrow, full body tomorrow as well. I love coming down to the park at the moment, just working out. So try and do it every day. A lot of strength base work today, pull up form, muscle up technique, and all sorts of stuff like that. So yeah, I feel good. Got a massive pump on, so it goes to show the less reps you do, uh, if you do it correctly, you'll still feel really good. So really happy with that, and yeah. Let's go have some scran, enjoy the rest of the day. But yeah, thanks for watching and we'll uh, we'll catch up in a bit. But I feel very good after that. Really good workout. Oh man, I feel like strong, do you know what I mean? I don't just feel pumped, I feel, my muscles feel solid. Yeah! Okay, see you in a bit. So the post-workout meal, lots of vitamins, high protein. I love my eggs, as you've seen in the intro, you know I love my eggs. And we're mixing together veggies, rice and peas, and then you chuck all the eggs in. So you do your veggies, and once you've done that, chuck the eggs in. Do all your veggies, chuck your rice in, and once you've done that, you put all the eggs in. Now, this one's a good one for the boys, for your family, for whatever you're doing. If, you both, if, you, if everyone's hitting a workout together, just whack all this in the pan and you're making burritos. I don't have wraps too often because I know they're not the best thing for you. And neither is sriracha, but it's been a long workout day. I feel like I worked really hard today. So you know when you just deserve a meal, this was that type of meal. So you basically pour all that in a wrap. It's like a breakfast, healthy, high protein wrap. And you haven't gone to the shop to buy like this, this stuff that's on the shelves, those types of wraps, because they're really not good for you. So making your own food is the way forward. And as you, as you can see, I've chucked mushrooms, peas, spinach, pepper. That's four of your five a day, essentially. I think the five a day is a myth. If you're not having five a day, five a day what are you doing? Like, that is a minimum requirement. But yes, anyway, rambling on. But this wrap was fire, and yeah, yeah, like I said, I'd love, I would have loved to share this with someone because you don't need all that protein. But I ended up eating the whole thing because it was, a, it was a big workout, and yeah, if you like me, you like to eat, so you've got to fuel the eating lifestyle. Yeah, love it, love it, gorgeous, gorgeous. But yeah, that's the video, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. I'm going to carry on with these vlogs, so just uh, keep up to date and we'll just keep evolving. Look after your body, stay healthy. Cheers.